it already go? Oh, I guess it is. Okay, so this is going to be the quickest update ever because we decided today that we're leaving tomorrow for New York. So I thought I'd do an update before because I can't do it while I'm over there. Yeah. So, alright, uh, so about three months. Here he is. Sleeping in his Moby, being sweet. Uh, last time I talked to you, I said I was looking through the night. Yeah, just kidding. A tease. He's a teaser. <laughs> not nice. No, he's sweet. But, um, so, I'm not sleeping through the night at all. Um, I got sick on Monday. I had a cold. Then my husband got it, and it was inevitable. He has it as well. I am paranoid, so I took him to the, to the doctor yesterday morning, and they said, can't do anything about it because he's too young. You just gotta spray saline up his nose, make sure, you know, you clean it out with bulb syringe and stuff. And, you know, it's only uh, dangerous if he stops eating because of the congestion, because he's too uncomfortable eating and can't breathe out of his nose. But he's alright, so he's eating good. Um, my kidney stone came out, and that's awesome. No more pain. Uh, what else? There's a there's a few things for new. Um, man, why do I do this to myself? So bath time is our favorite time, and I'm trying to set like uh, I don't know what I said, like routines uh, before we go to bed. So you know we take a bath like every couple nights. Uh, so we take a bath, and we get him in his jammies, and I put like light music on in a dark room, and I nurse him, and I usually top him off with some formula or just a breast milk bottle, um, just to get a routine down so I can start going to bed. With the time change, I and Jose are getting tired at like 9 o'clock, which is crazy because we usually go to bed a lot later than that. Um, so last night we went to bed before 10. Let me check who that is real quick. It's my grandma. Hold on. Hey, grandma. Huh? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Well, next weekend. Oh no. Okay. Is maybe we can come during the week this week? Tomorrow. Yes, we decided that today. Just to be there. We're going to be there for like two weeks now. I'm anxious too. Hmm? Of course. Of course. Okay. He is growing like a weed. He's so big. Almost 13. My nice, huge. <laughs> yeah, he's a good baby. I mean, he only cries when he wants something. Oh, nighttime. Um, you know, he kind of teased. Yeah, sometimes he sleeps like seven hours, which is great, but sometimes he sleeps four or three. You know, <laughs> just depends on the night. Right. Right. It's all different every night. We're leaving tomorrow. 
Okay, sounds right. All right. Me too. Love you. Okay. All right. Bye. That was my grandma. Sorry, you had to listen to that. I really don't know how to cut these. I'm gonna try though. If all right, anyway. So I don't even know where I was. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, I got Oreo all over his face. Don't wake up. I'm trying to like pack like crazy. We weren't supposed to week we weren't supposed to week. We weren't supposed to leave for another week. So we all of a sudden I just really miss my family and I think because I understand that. I'm pretty sure it does because he was like, Let's just leave. I was like, Thank God, I'm so ready to go. It's a long drive, it's eleven and a half hours, probably with him it's gonna be like fifteen. You know, which is fine. Stop more, walk around. You know, sit down to eat, kind of deal. Uh, right. So, <laughs> I don't know why I make videos without making a list. Okay, so I took him to the doctor yesterday, and it's like his two bottom teeth. They look like they're gonna come through soon, and he's been extra cranky. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna come through. And she said they look like they're, you know. They're going to come through soon. They haven't broken through yet, but they're close. Uh, so that's kind of exciting and not. Because <laughs> I thought it wasn't going to be for like at least another three months. And uh, for my nipple sake at least. <laughs> but uh, my mom tells me these horror stories about how we used to fall asleep nursing. And then like we'd get startled and bite. Oh, Anyway. Anywho, but I nursed till I was three years old. So that's... You got a full, you know, full mouth full of teeth. So, he is 22 inches long and almost 13 pounds. Crazy how fast he's growing. And, uh, he's doing great. I mean, I, except for night times, I don't really have anything to complain about. I love being a mom, and I have a really hard time believing him. And I haven't left them except for the two times that I had to go to the hospital. But uh, I think my mother-in-law would really enjoy me being ready to leave them. But I'm just not. Uh, so. That's that, I guess. But. Yeah, he's just. You know, he starts smiling and laughing. And he rolls over. Uh, and in the one video I put up, he's really cranky when I did it. But the other day he didn't. He was as happy as happy as clam. So it just depends, you know. He is a sweet, sweet boy, um, and I just feel really lucky because we did have a miscarriage, and I just feel extra lucky that we have a child. Um, so anyway, oh, no, that's not what I was talking about before. I can't remember. Okay, so at night time, I usually swaddle him, but a loose swaddle. And just because sometimes he startles himself, he like throws his hands up, and, like touches his face and he wakes up. So I like to do a light swaddle. Regardless of how tight or loose the swaddle is, thin or thick material, he is sweats. He sweats all the time. I mean, he's sweating against me right now, and it's not hot in here. 71 degrees in here. You know, just, uh, he's just a sweater. So, um, I'm not swaddling him as much. He doesn't really need to be swaddled anyway. Just at night, it's kind of convenient to not wake him up, but, ah, whatever. I'll wake up, with him. I don't mind too much. So, um, I just enjoy him all the time, being happy. Oh, yeah, so he only cries when he wants something. Other than that, he's happy, and he likes being held. God forbid if I'd put him down, he'll let me know that he doesn't like it, you know. <clears throat> he's funny. But, so we got cable a few months ago. We never we didn't have cable for a few months before that. And, uh, I mean, the TV was fairly easy. But we have a nice TV, and we decided let's get cable because I'm here all day, and he sleeps a lot. After I, you know, clean the house and everything, make food, because he's housewife, um, I like to watch the little TV. Anyway, I think it was a bad idea. 
Because Sensei gets off work and sets the TV and zones out until he goes to sleep. Which is kind of like, bah! So we talked about it, so it's kind of changed, kind of. Also, we bought the My Baby Can Read system, which is pretty cool. Um, I like doing it with him, and he likes it. He laughs. It's like, you know, it says the card on it. It says, like, um, nose. You, like, say to him a few times, and then you pull out, and there's a nose. And they're right over here. I'll show you. Okay. So it's like, obviously it's backwards too, guys. And then you just pull it out, and there's a mouth. I just think that's cool. Definitely worth the money. And uh, so, we're doing that, and it's going good. Um, definitely going to do swimming lessons when he is six months. We're going to do the swimming at the YMCA. He doesn't go back to the doctor till December, and then he goes to the hospital in December as well, just a few days before Christmas, uh, because he was premature. He has like uh, they like check him to see how his how his movements are, how he can hold his head up, smiling, every you know physical growth, I guess. Um, and they'll track him for two years uh, because I guess that's when he actually. Is caught up, caught up mentally and physically. Cause his, I know his smile was a little delayed for a few weeks and stuff. So I'm happy that they follow up like that. I think that's really good. Yeah. So that's about it. Not much else is new. Um, I really, really have to take a shower today. I feel disgusting and dye my hair. I don't like this at all. Um, because last night. We're going to bed, and sometimes I put him on my chest after I feed him, and I burp him. And he spit up all in my hair. Yeah, that's why I have him in this cute little bun, because I haven't had time to take a shower yet. <laughs> Probably too much information. Who cares? Uh, anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching. And I will be back after New York. Cross my fingers, no snow while we're up there. Because we have got to travel to Long Island and back up north and, you know, I'd hate for there to be snow. So thank you for watching. <laughs> and for subscribing. You know, I don't, I don't have any updates for when you subscribe. To say thank you for subscribing. So this is for in total thank you for subscribing and for watching. And I will see you soon. And I hope everybody has a happy holidays. Bye.